Okay, so we're here with the Panasonic video camera model WV3060 and we're going to do a teardown on this to see what's inside. So we'll just start by removing the lens. Okay, simple as that. We're not going to take that apart, of course. And now there's a little rubber cap here in the handle. Let's see if we can get that out. Covers a screw. Okay, and we're going to take the handle apart. Maybe. Alright, so the handle is actually held on here with a few screws on the hinge, and that should take it right off, I think. Yes, okay, there we go. The handle is off. Okay. So we're just going to leave the hinge on there. And now, of course, we're not going to worry about taking the um, shoe off for a light. And there's four screws on the bottom. two screws back here underneath the viewfinder. screw top of the microphone and we see there's just a small wire there connecting inside the microphone and you think this was still on apparently it doesn't we're gonna take you off after all maybe screw underneath that Looks like there is these two screws here holding the shoe on, and this is just a little spring clip that presses against the bottom of whatever you have to help secure it a little better. And shoe is off, and there's no screws holding that. Okay, there we go. Oh, that's just clip on the sides. There, simple as that. Okay, and the microphone has a small connection to the circuit board inside. And we unplug that, and we're good to go with that. Set that off to the side. And there's a little warning label in here. Warning to indicate presence of high voltage arc anode lead to leaf spring for CRT. And we see inside here is the small CRT for the viewfinder and down in here we see the SATICON tube. Okay. So we'll remove this circuit board here. Two screws and it should just come out. Okay, there we go, and that come, folds out like that. 
and it's on little hinge pieces in here. There's one on this side and one down over here. And we'll take the two screws out for the other board. and that one's mounted in pretty much the same way. And there's a flex cable underneath the two to connect the two boards. So let's see if we can remove these ribbon connectors carefully. Actually, these aren't ribbon connectors. They're actually small pin connectors. You can see that. There's little pins on those. Okay, and disconnect all these wires here. One screw here holding this little plastic hinge. And that looks like a soldered ground connection which goes to the other side over here. And help me with screw. markings on here to tell it what it is. And the only marking on this board is VPR A3063PA. <clears throat> and now we'll go about removing the other board. And here there's a little, presumably a small truck very small flyback transformer in here for the high voltage for the CRT of the viewfinder. No high tension in here. screws holding this board in. Small. There's some wires going up to the front. I'm not sure where those go to. They run into the front red and black wire that run into the front near the SATACON tube. Okay, and this wire here is soldered in. Where does that go? That goes to the CRT connector. There's also high voltage leads going into, high 
high tension leads going into the SATICON tube, and we're not, I don't believe we're going to be able to remove those. Those appear to be soldered on. A little tie here, we'll move that. Attempt to anyway. Okay, we can just leave that, I guess. Okay. Alright, so there's some screws under, there's a little plastic cover on here. To remove. And I'm going to need something a little bit finer than that, so we'll be right back. <laughs> 